Hi guys, so for this video I'm using yarn in size 2 and the crochet hook in size size 3.5 millimeters. I will start by making a slip knot and now I will chain 16. Now that I've chained 16, on the last chain from the hook, I'll make a slip stitch. Now for row 1, I'll chain 3. Now right here through this loop, we need to make 32 double crochet. This 3 chain already counts as 1. Now that we have made 32 double crochets, to complete row 1, right here through this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. This completes row 1. For row 2, I'll chain 3. Now we need to make 8 double crochet, but this 3 chain counts as 1. So we need to make uh, 1 double crochet through each next 7 chains. This is the 3 chain in the beginning of the row, counts as 1, and that will give us 8 double crochet. So we have 5, 6, 7, and 8. I'll chain 3. Now through the next 8 chains, I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. I'll chain 3, again now through the next 8 chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. Now I'll chain 3, through the next 8 chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. Now 
Now to complete row 2, I'll chain 3. Then right here to this third chain, I'll make a slip stitch. This completes row 2. Now for row 3, I'll chain 3. Through the next 7 chains, I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. I'll chain three. Now through this next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Chain three. Through the next eight double crochet chains I'll make one double crochet through each chain. chain 3, through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through the next 8 double crochet chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. chain 3, then through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through the next 8 double crochet chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. Chain 3, now through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet. Now to complete row 3, I'll chain 3, then right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. This completes row 3. Now for row 4, I'll chain 3, through the next 7 double crochet chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. Chain 3, through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through the next 8 double crochet chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. chain 3, now through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through the next 8 double crochet chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain. I'll chain 3, through this next 3 chain loop I'll make 1 single crochet, chain 3, through this next 3 chain loop 1 single crochet, chain 3, through this next 8 double crochet chains I'll make 1 double crochet through each chain.
again now I will chain three through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet chain three through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet and now to complete row four I'll chain three now through his third chain I'll make a slip stitch this completes row four now I'll chain ten Now I'll skip the next six double crochet chains and through his last double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain three. Through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Chain three. Through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet. And this is row five. I'll chain three. Through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet. I'll chain three through his next double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet chain seven I'll skip the next six double crochet chains and through his last double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet chain three through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet chain three through his next three chain loop one single crochet chain three through the next three chain loop one single crochet chain three through his next double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet chain seven I'll skip the next six double crochet chain and through his next double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet again I'll chain three Through his next three chain loop I'll make one single crochet. Chain three. Through his next three chain loop one single crochet. Chain three. Through the next three chain loop one single crochet. Chain three. Through his next double crochet chain one double crochet. Chain seven. I'll skip the next six double crochet chain and through his last double crochet chain I'll make one double crochet. I'll chain three through his next three chain loop one single crochet. Chain three through his next three chain loop one single crochet. Chain three through his next three chain loop one single crochet. Now to complete row five I'll chain three then right here through this third chain I'll make a slip stitch. So this completes row 5. Now I'll chain 1, then I'll cut this yarn. This square measures 5 inches. This is all for today guys, we'll see you next time with another video.